Chin Squiz Jr. Uh, my last post, I talked about the devastating mass shooting of 11 uh, Jewish people who were killed in that mass shooting. And I talked about the human race and how we should all be together and feeling the pain of this loss of human life together. So as I was walking today to go to the train station, I saw this and it says, healing together. That's exactly what it is that I was talking about, healing together. We as a people need to stop the nonsense of separating ourselves because of race and economic status and the haves and the have not. Because at the end of the day, we are all trying to strive and do the same thing. And as you can see, the separation of races is not working out too well for us, okay? We as a people need to vote out these politicians who do not have our best interests at hand. And as you, when I open the paper, this is also what I saw. The rabbis prepare a mass of unity. That's what they want to see. A mass of unity. People coming together, regardless of race, regardless of religious beliefs, regardless of economic status, regardless of education. We, as a society, need to band together the people. What does the Constitution of the United States start it with? We, the people, we need to band together against the politicians, against the political machines that is dividing and making a society full of hate. We are going backwards. We are not going forward. We are going backwards. We, the people, need to make things better for our children. It is the next generation that is suffering from all of this political upheaval. So I thought that I would just share that with you today. I thought that this was just a beautiful sign, something beautiful, healing together. That is the only way that we as a people will make this world a better place. So I am going to leave you with this, love and unity.